Hello everybody, welcome back to another video where today we are here with the sewers of Rogni. This is the first quest to the first dungeon of your journey to win. Now, of course I haven't been uploading very constantly, I'm very sorry about that. Still trying to figure out the replay mod. The replay mod, it's so difficult with Windcraft apparently, somehow. You know, it's not even that hard to make Windcraft generate. I've been sitting in front of LI and it came and generated the terrain. Honestly, kind of sad because I heard the replay mod was very, very good. I'm also dabbling in animation, I guess. Now, of course, I'm not going to be releasing any animations anytime soon. More like maybe a year or so i may or may not release but here we go here um back on topic we are at the decreed sewers dungeon you're supposed to talk to gen press over here now i'm not even going to do my normal intro it's kind of embarrassment to not upload constantly now the entrance is just right nearby the decreed sewers of course you have to right click gen press don't forget to right click him, I already right clicked uh, Jempress. Now just climb up these stairs and then go through this big giant scary hole. Now some brief information about the uh, dungeon. If you're a mage or a archer, well good luck for you because you're gonna have the time of your life, which I mean you're going to have the most difficult time of your life. Now just enter. Explore the sewer, which means just walk straight forward whenever you can. Oh goodness, a lag. Get out of here, you nubs. Now of course you're going to do some simple parkour. If you never, if you don't know what parkour is, it's basically jumping. I'm sure you all know what parkour is. Oh, hello. Hi, scary thing. Very scary. You know, this dungeon is just made to creep you out. Yes, yes. Found blockage up ahead. Now it'll give you a small explosive. Now this might be coming in handy. Now, of course, what you want to do is do what it says. Right click to explode. Now, there was a button over here that um, forces you to... There was a button that was kind of unclear, so I think they removed that. It's very confusing, honestly. Hello, hi, scary. Yeah, spooky sewer. Rotting skeletons. Very, very scary indeed. Now, if you're not freaked out by all of these nonsense, just head over to here, where there are clearly bar cages that you should not go in. Now, you'll be greeted with the rot uh, rotting skeletons and, of course, the Grim Reaper. Now, apparently, the Grim Reaper is not very that it's not strong at all. So I don't know what that's for. I'm surprised. Supposedly, the Grim Reaper is supposed to, you know, be strong and all. I suppose not. Now, what I mean about you're going to have a great time with this dungeon if you're a mage or an archer. Wait, was it mage or archer? I think I'm missing something. Wait. Oh, come. I'm actually stupid. I just threw my gumball in there. Wait, is it gumball? No, explosive. I just threw my explosive there. I'm, I'm actually done. Okay. What you're supposed to do, unlike me, is supposed to put in the Reaper Skull. But now I have to do a slash uh, fix quest. Yep. Yes, yes. Fix quest. This is a handy way if you lose your uh, items. Uh, yes, okay, fine. 
Now what you're supposed to do here is to click this uh, a pretty obvious button. That way it will enable all of this parkour to fall on, blah blah blah. Now of course this parkour is definitely timed, so be sh so I hope you guys are good at parkour. Scary. There wasn't even a phase. The last time it had a witherhead phase. Come on, that's lame. And now you have to escape out of this place because apparently it's flooding for some reason. So just make your right, uh, way out. Make sure not to get in these crevices because that will be your downfall. No, I don't. I don't. I don't have the explosive. Oh, you don't even need explosive. What a scam! And then, of course, it just uh, and then it happens to knock all of this entrance out, even though it was probably miles away. Somehow. Now, what you want to do is go back out and talk to Jim Press. Hello, hi, please spawn in. Are you gonna magically appear from the air? Yes, thank you. Yes, yeah, sealed for a reason, old Rogni prison. Well then, you get a pretty good chest plate, so I do suggest uh, getting this chest plate on. It is very good for this level. You also get one discreet serious key, like every other dungeon. Now, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know. I haven't been uploading constantly. I'm truly sorry about that. Oh, okay, perfect. Bam. Luminescent ink. Love. Now, I'm off topic here, but... I haven't been uploading constantly. I know that. I'm just dabbling in the arts of replay mod, apparently. And it's giving me a real big headache. So if anybody is patient enough with me to teach me how replay mod works on Windcraft, be sure to help me out. Now, I may release a video on my struggles with the replay mod. I'm not too sure about that, but I may release a video and then private it later as a side note to to let you guys know what I'm experiencing right now. So, I hope you guys aren't too mad with me with not reporting constantly, but yeah, I'll see you guys in another video and goodbye.